Hi guys, we warn you in advance that this video will not feature the most famous volcanoes, like Etna, Stromboli and Krakato, that have appeared in our previous videos. We have prepared a brand new video of rare and amazing lava leaks for you. Welcome to our channel. So sit back, relax, grab a glass of something warm to drink, and let's go on our journey. But first, already leave your like and subscribe to the channel so you won't miss more amazing videos. Niragongo Volcano, Democratic Republic of Congo Mount Niragongo in the Democratic Republic of Congo looks like a giant bowl of lava spreading out from its rim, about to overflow. This volcano has actually overflowed several times in its history, and the last time it did was very recently, in 2021. Particularly dangerous is the fact that Mount Niragongo is located in a densely populated area. Therefore, Mount Niragongo is among the so-called volcanoes of the decade, and the International Association of Volcanology and Chemistry of the Earth's Interior recommends that it be observed with special care. The Volcano Observatory in Goma City has followed their recommendations, but with modifications to suit local characteristics. In 2020, the World Bank restricted funding for this observatory due to corruption problems. Even under these circumstances, the researchers were able to warn of the danger, and the eruption occurred 12 days after the warning. The lava flow rose towards the town of Goma at a speed of 1 km per hour, but fortunately did not reach it. However, the 17 neighboring villages were affected and the lava flows destroyed about a thousand houses. Tens of thousands of people were evacuated from nearby dangerous areas. The lava leaks easily toppled houses and burned everything in their path, so running away was the best option. Yeser Volcano, Vanuatu Mount Yeser is a major tourist attraction in Vanuatu and it is very easy to get to this volcano. And it is active all the time. Mount Yeser is truly the beacon of the Pacific and took the famous James Cook to the island 250 years ago. The mount and its has been erupting for almost 800 years and the result of this activity is a huge lava road. Thrill seekers walk the path of Mount Yeser. Actually, the environment on Mount Yeser is severe. Eruptions are frequent, sometimes several times an hour. In addition, Mount Yeser has a restless temperament. Therefore, if you are distracted, you may encounter a lava fountain like this one. Piton de la Fournaise Volcano, France the volcano Piton de la Fournaise, or Furnace Ridge, is appropriately named within this furnace on the island of Reunion in the Indian Ocean. A hot lava soup is simmering, often spilling over the surface. In 400 years, the Piton de la Fournaise volcano has erupted more than 150 times, making it one of the most active volcanoes in the world. Naturally, there are several craters within the caldera, but fortunately most eruptions do not leave the caldera. The lava flows periodically destroy local paved roads, but rarely reach the villages. However, it did happen in 1977 and the Church of Notre Dame de Slaves, or Our Lady of the Lava, is a testament to what happened then. The last major eruption occurred in 2007, when approximately 3 million cubic meters of lava flowed out of the caldera in one day. The reunion authorities cannot remain indifferent to such natural fury and are currently monitoring the volcano's activity. This is important for the safety of the local population and to maintain tourist numbers. After all, the Piton de la Fournaise volcano is a major tourist attraction in the region. Many tourists come here to walk along the green sands and film the gushing lava. Erda Ale Volcano, Ethiopia The interior of Ethiopia's most active volcano contains lava lakes, sometimes even two together. The main lava lake has existed for over 100 years and periodically overflows from the southern slope of the mountain. 
When it gets too full, it is also possible that local residents refer to this place as the gates of hell. The stable situation in Ethiopia makes it quite difficult to get to the mountain, and tourists must always be accompanied by an armed escort. Even so, if these tourists manage to get there, they never drop their cameras. Some people, particularly impatient, try to awaken the lava lakes, as by simply throwing a container of water on the lava, as this video shows. The water in a scalding environment quickly turns into steam, tearing the resistance of the lava, causing it to gush out along with the bubbles. The lava immediately churns violently. Attention! It is dangerous. Don't try to imitate it. Your experience will be exciting even if you don't do it. Mount Erebus, Antarctica Antarctica is the coldest continent on Earth, where the lowest temperatures on the planet have been recorded, it would be almost impossible from a logical standpoint for this place to have a fiery larva volcano, but Antarctica is home to one of the most active volcanoes on Earth and the oldest lava lakes on the planet. The volcano has to be monitored because Rossi Island, where Mount Erebus is located is home to Antarctic stations from the United States and New Zealand. Even in such a cold place, it is amazing to find a volcano as amazing as Mount Erebus. Reventador Volcano, Ecuador The name Reventador, translated as explosion, is a good description of the character of this mountain. One of the most active volcanoes in Ecuador. Fortunately, Mount Reventador is located far from human habitation and does not pose a threat to people's lives or health. However, Reventador does not go unnoticed, as it is constantly active. Since 2008, the Reventador volcano has been constantly spewing lava, ash, and rock fragments at breakneck speed. The phenomenon is quite spectacular. Just imagine, in August 2021, 74 eruptions were recorded in a single day at the Reventador, with the hits reaching an average height of 1,600 meters. It is best to stay away from a volcano like this if you have nothing to do there. Fire Peak, Cape Verde Fire Peak was the Portuguese name given to this mountain. It is the highest peak in West Africa and received the significant name. Practically the entire area of the island of Fogo is occupied by the Fire Peak, which is 2,829 meters high. 73,000 years ago the eastern part of the Fire Peak collapsed into the sea, causing a tsunami of 100 meters high. According to the researchers' calculations, however, even in modern times Fire Peak remains a source of danger. When a major eruption occurred in 1995, lava flow and rupture 120 meters from the crater and lava bombs up to 4 m in diameter spread up to 500 meters from the fire peak. As a result, 1,200 local residents had to be evacuated to safety. In 2014, the fire peak made its presence known again in a continuous eruption for 7-7 seven, seven days. The locals had to be evacuated again. But this time, everyone got out safely. This time, however, more than 100 million tons of maggot oozed out of the volcano, destroying houses and roads in several nearby villages. By the way, here are some interesting facts. The lava is not only a destructive force, but is also used by the inhabitants as building material for constructing circular huts called funko. Fagradalsjall, Iceland for this lava leak compilation of ours, we couldn't leave out Iceland's Fagradalsjall volcano. Honestly, you were expecting Fagradalsjall volcano, weren't you? Of course, because this volcano is not only active but also spectacular. Plus, the Fagradalsjall volcano is only 40 kilometers from Iceland's capital, Reykjavik. This means that there are always many tourists here with cameras and smartphones, and some even have drones.
It is worth noting that this volcano was silent for 6,000 years before it was awakened from its slumber as a result of several consecutive earthquakes. A fissure formed on the southern slope of Mount Fagradalskjöll on March 19, 2021, became an outlet for lava that continues to break out of the fissure periodically until September in 2022. The eruptions have started again, and the spectacular images captured by the cameras have once again delighted people. There are no settlements at the foot of the Fagradalskjöll volcano, so the eruption of large amounts of lava flows poses no danger to the local population. Tourists, on the other hand, are attracted like magnets. This is because on the slopes of Mount Fagradalskjöll it is easy to make impressive videos. If you like this video, please don't hesitate to leave your likes. So, we are coming to the end of another video. Thank you all for your attention. We hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it, please write a comment and subscribe to our channel. Please set up notifications by activating the little bell so that you can be the first to see new videos. Your viewing is very important to us. We have two more great videos to point you to, they are appearing on your screen now. See you in the next videos. Bye.